okay so we finally got the time to answer your questions which is good and um yes i'm so excited Hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel anyway today we got the chance to do the video that a lot of you have been asking for questions it's a q and a i wrote down your questions and i will answer them i have my colleagues who will help me give some answers and yes yeah, stay tuned don't forget to subscribe chris chris will tell us about life on board chris how is the life on board okay life on board uh. first of all good evening Christopher from Jamaica. Life on road is beautiful. I always say everything inside. Okay? <laughs> no need to go outside, everything inside. Wow! <laughs> hey, this is Suji. Suji is always very happy, guys. He's very smiling. Hey, Suji, what can you tell somebody who wants to work in the, in the ship? It's exciting, you know? It's exciting, huh? Yes. How? We can. Oh wow! How about the money? Excellent. Hi, this is Gede. Gede, how is your life on board? Kaput. You know kaput. What is the meaning of kaput? We don't know. We don't know. Tell us. Huh? We don't know. Tell us. <laughs> what? What can you tell somebody who wants to work in the ship? Huh? What can you tell someone who wants to work in the I'll ship? Check this one. Chef, what can you tell another chef who wants to work in the ship? How is life on board if you want to work in the ship as a chef? What can you say? How is your life? Chef is happy. I did chef, I did chef. Don't be like Gege, huh? I did, Do something, man. Put everything inside. Zack, Zack, we finish, guys. Check, check porno. Check porno. Like Gege there. <laughs> Like Almost like a yeah. This one always like a yeah. Check, check, check another one. Another one. Hi, my name is Christian, and I'm a utility cleaner at Celebrity Constellation. And the life on board is hard and tiring, but it's worth it because I earn money. <laughs> Tell us about your life on board. Hi guys, so my life on board is amazing. I can say 10 out of 10. And for those who are going to be joining us from all over the world, of course, be ready to work 27 hours a day. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, have fun. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, this is Lee. Lee, tell us about, tell us about your experience, life on board. It's very wonderful to work with beautiful colleagues from all around the world, mm. especially Jackie. <laughs> I've been learning under her all her trains, and I really thank her. And when you come on board, you'll be missing your family at the same time. You'll be enjoying. So be ready to come on board and work hard and earn and support your family members. Yay! Hi, this is David. David, tell us about uh, your life on board. Oh, what can you tell somebody joining us? Hi, hi Jackie, how are you? <laughs> amazing. Yeah, my life on board is amazing. I just recommend you some of the, my lovely colleagues from Dominica, from Kenya, from Philippines. All over the world. All around the world, if you want to come to work in the ship, just be ready to work uh, 12 hours per day. Mm. You have very nice salary, to have very good life. And the see the world. You can go. Enjoy, take a picture, buy some madness if you like it. Amazing. But be ready for the hard job. I love you guys. Thank this you. is Krishna. Krishna, share with us how is the experience on board? Yeah, it's excellent. You know, if you're working the ship, you can go around the board and you can have the experience. It's yeah. okay, of course, I believe it. You can get a good money. Nice. The question <laughs> is, how much money did you, do you spend to get on board? 
Okay, so how much money do you spend to get on board? First things first, you need to know you need to have a visa, you need to pay for the tickets, yes. Mm -hmm. So visa depends on the place you're going, you're joining the ship. Ticket also depends on the place you're joining the ship. However, it's like uh, approximately $2,000, $2, yeah, approximately $2,000, yeah. Including the ticket. Yeah, including the ticket, visa yeah. plus the ticket, mm -hmm. plus the medical. Yes, yeah. everything in it. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, so how to be ready to work at sea? First, you need to make sure you are physically fit. As in, when you do your medical, you need to make sure everything is up to the company standards. You need to be ready to work long hours, because anyway, remember you're working every single day. You need to be ready to work long hours. You need to be mentally prepared, um, emotionally prepared, because you're staying far away from your family. And um, what else? What else am I forgetting? Patience. You need to be patient, I mean. And you need to love. You must love what you do. Exactly. Otherwise, if you don't love what you do, then maybe you might be in the wrong place. Yes, if yeah. you ask me. So you need to be ready physically, mentally, emotionally yeah. ready to do and to be ready to work far away from your family. Yes. You need to be prepared with the... Mm -hmm. Not, uh, I mean, you cannot work more than 13 hours a day, right? Mm -hmm. So, but be ready, you might work 13 hours or 12 hours or more or less. It depends. But of course, it's in shift. You cannot work like continuous. Mm -hmm. You work in breaks. So, for example, you work breakfast, you take a short break, you come back. But it's like 13, not more than 13 hours a day. Yeah. Tattoos, to be honest with you, in the cruise industry, is different from the airlines. Cruise industries, yes, you can work with tattoo as long as if you're in the hospitality, it's um, it's not like a really showing tattoo. Mm -hmm. So if you know you have a showing tattoo, mm -hmm. it's recommended you put like a long sleeve or you put something long sleeve if your shirt is short to cover the tattoos. But yes, tattoo. So with the cruise ship application, guys, you need to be patient. You can apply. For example, me, I applied. It took me one year to join the ship. So it needs a lot of patience. Sometimes they can call you early, depending on the business needs, guys. But patience is a really first requirement when you're applying the ship. It takes, it might take, it might take three months. It might take six months. It might take one year. Depend. It depends on also on your documents, whatever you need. Like if you're ready with the visa. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you're ready with the visa and everything, but if the business needs doesn't require mm -hmm. your position that time. You might be cancelled, but that doesn't mean you will not join. Eventually, you will join when the time comes. Life at sea, guys, this one from my side, I will say I enjoy life at sea. What you need to do, the secret to enjoy life at sea is to make friends. Make your work environment conducive for you and for your colleagues. But all right my love so from here i had to do an audio because of course copyrights and i don't want my my video to be pulled down since there are some people who really wants to watch the video all the time so sometimes we do have amazing times we do party a lot and this over here is a real operation so we do have like our galley the <laughs> kitchen is in level number three Get it. and the waiters and assistant Get waiters it. they come down to pick up their food <laughs> And then they bring it through the escalators to level number four, which is the main restaurant, guys, and five. So in a real operation, this is how it works. And yeah, life on board is amazing. So what we're going to do, comment whatever videos and questions that you have. Like this on the YouTube channel is easy. You can always come back and check on the videos and check on the answers. <laughs> Any questions, don't forget to add, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Bye. give me the morale to do these videos, enjoy, bye bye.